Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about how to create EC2s with AWS CLI. For doing that, we need to have configured the AWS credentials in our system. Uh, the command AWS configure will help you to have this ready. So the access key and the secret key will be ready to deploy instances in the, in the cloud. Okay, we have here the AWS CLI, this AWS command. Then we need to select the service that we need to affect, in this case EC2, because we are going to create one EC2 instance. Then we need the command, in this case run hyphen instances to create a new instance, and then the options or the parameters. I'm going to specify the image ID, in this case is the AMI which we are going to get from the console in a moment. Then we have the count. In this case, I'm going to deploy three instances. Let's say three virtual machines, a uh, copy of each other. And we have the instance type. Here I'm going to specify T2 micro, which is um, available on the free tire and the key name because we need the the access key to get into the into the ec2 once created so let's go to the to the console and here you can get the id from the image that we are going to use in my case i'm going to use the red hat one okay i'm going to specify it in the command and I'm going to deploy these three instances. Okay, the instances have been deployed in the cloud. You can get here the instances ID. This one. If we go down, we can find another one here. This that ends with the eight. And the third one here, 95. Okay, then we can list the, the instances that we have running with this command, AWS, the service EC2, describe instances, and we need to do a query because the result, as you saw, came in JSON format, so we need to, to get the the member that we need instances instance id uh, this is reservations okay and the command will return the active instances that i have and we have here these are the ones that we just created with the previous command by doing this, you will be able to automate your deployments or your infrastructure deployments. And along with uh, another provider, let's say Terraform, you will be able to deploy complex infrastructures. And, and I will show you how in later videos. Please subscribe to the channel and let me know your comments. Thanks.